Lexus CT200H review, can the hybrid hatch still compete? Yes, but there's no point holding you in suspense about what the Lexus CT200 hours is like. For a start, it's 6 years old now. Normally, 7 years is a car's life cycle, so we never revisit a car this close to the shotgun behind the bar moment. But, ready for 2018. Lexus has given the CT200H some TLC. So, we need a What's new? It's been restyled with sharper headlights, spot the running lights now at the top, like an angry eyebrow, and more aggressive than motifs set into the bumpers. The range has been slimmed down from the 7 trim variants to 5, and inside there's a much larger and screen. 10.3 in play 7.0 on everything but the base model. That starts at 23,495 pounds, or 299 pounds a month. The top premier model we drove with all the toys costs 30,495 pounds. That's barely a facelift. That's more anti-wrinkle cream and makeup. True. What it shows is that Lexus thinks, knows, in fact, this car is still relevant. And getting more pertinent by the day, really. Back in 2011, the brand spanking new, hybrid only CT200H was tricky to make a case for, as Turbosaurus were a hatchback company car came The world lived in a diesel dictatorship. Now, diesel gave launched a coup on herbs from the thin part, and all of a sudden, Diesel sales have tumbled from 51% of European car sales at their peak to sub 40% right now, and falling. So you're saying this is the time for the Lexus CT to come good? Exactly. Especially as there aren't that many more premium badge hybrids to choose from. There's the Audi A3 e-tron, which we like, and it's really twin, the VW Golf GTP which suffers slightly for its time a real hot hat honest for tensions. So we have the Audi. Except, it costs £36,040, or £33,540 after the £2,500 plug-in grant gets deducted. Advantage Lexus. And I don't ever plug the Lexus into a wall, do I?